Hey guys and welcome back to another new Animal Crossing New Horizons video. I'm Crossing Channel and in today's video I'm going to be going over a bunch of new details about Animal Crossing New Horizons that have emerged from PAX in America where there was actually a demo of the game. So let's check all these cool new details about the game out right now. First of all here we can see the music select screen obviously for KK Slider's songs and we have a new track here from him actually called Welcome Horizons. I really like the cover art, it's very fitting for Animal Crossing New Horizons, of course. Here we can see the name of this horse villager who we actually have seen before, and her name is Renee. She is of course new to Animal Crossing New Horizons, this is her first appearance. Hopefully people won't confuse her with a rhino villager who's also called Renee. Obviously the spelling's a bit different, this one has a spelling to sort of make a horse pun, but the other one sort of has the uh, French spelling, I believe. So yeah, <laughs> they have the same name, but it's just spelled a bit differently. Here we can see that Tommy is talking about a new service provided from Nook's Cranny, and he says, the last new service we're offering is the drop-off box you can find in front of the shop. Say you're in a hurry or the shop is closed, you can just drop off any items you want to sell. Easy, right? And then finally he says, we'll pay you later by sending the funds directly to your bank account. So this is a really cool new service that they have. I think this is definitely going to be really useful for people who maybe can't make it into the shop in time. They can just sell stuff outside. So that's a really cool new thing that they've added to the game. Here we can see the mail screen. And you can see some really cool details here. So the design of it has completely changed. You can store up to 300 letters as you can see in the corner. And you can even favorite a piece of mail as well. They've really changed the mail system a lot, as you can see, and I think that's really great. You can see here on this screen uh, a letter from Mum, and it says, My dear Lindsay, whenever I see a plane, I think of you and wave at those airborne strangers with all my might. I had no idea how many flights took off each day. My arm is exhausted. So that's very cute, of course. Mum is known to send lots of letters in Animal Crossing, so it's good to see those are back. Here we can see that by using your energy, you can actually destroy rocks. Now we knew previously that you could dig up trees by doing this, but the fact that you can actually destroy rocks is great too. This screenshot here shows that you can use fruits from around your island to craft furniture. I think that'll definitely come in handy. This screenshot here shows off a tab on the character customization screen, and it shows that you can have face paint. I definitely think people are going to do some creative things with that. This screenshot here shows off some welcome mats. I mean, you can see one below this player's foot in the bottom that literally screams welcome at you. Here we can see that Isabel is doing a bit of brushing around resident services. I just thought that was really cute and I had to show that off. It's just, it's adorable. But Isabel isn't the only helpful one. Tom Nook will also do a bit of sweeping and brushing around resident services. Both these guys are obviously working together very hard to keep the place nice and clean. Here we can see the outside of Blava's tent, which is really good to see. We did talk about his tent in a previous video, but here is the outside of it finally. And of course, here is the inside of it as well, where we can see Blava's and a bunch of assorted gear and shelves and stuff around him, which I love a lot. This place is really nice looking inside. Here we can see that Black Roses are confirmed to return. I mean, it's not really much of a surprise, but we haven't seen them in the game so far. So it's just nice to have a look at them, basically. Now, one of my viewers, Gianni, actually shared this with me, and he mentioned that you can jump over holes in Animal Crossing New Horizons. I'm definitely sure that will come in handy for some people. Uh, it's just, it's, it's kind of funny that you can jump in Animal Crossing now. I like that a lot, it's it's cool. <laughs> it's something that I've seen, actually seen people ask for for quite a while now, so there it is. Here you can see that the golden spot that was last seen in the original Animal Crossing game on the GameCube has actually made a return in this version. Now this is something that I personally wanted to return a lot. I really love this golden spot, and you can see the player has dug up some bells from the golden spot here, so it's really cool to see that come back after all these years. Finally, speaking of the GameCube game, players at PAX discovered that you could actually change the camera angle by having a sort of top-down angle, which is very similar to how the GameCube game actually looks. So you can have a top-down angle, which I think is really nice. I know a lot of people have been asking for more camera control, so this is definitely good news to see indeed. And I'm really excited about all of these details. PAX was definitely uh, lucrative when it came to new details. There's a lot that came out of there. I mean, I've done another video on some details about this as well. 
So yeah, it's really good to see all of this stuff come out of packs. I'm definitely very happy about it. If you guys want to help support the channel, click the join button down below the video to become a member of the Bob's Gang. You can get a bunch of really cool packs for doing so, and it helps me out a whole bunch. Thank you guys so much for watching that video. If you enjoyed, be sure to hit the like button, and you can also subscribe for even more Animal Crossing New Horizons content. You can also check me out on Instagram and Twitter, and I even have a Discord server. The links are all in the video description.